Okay, grab the, grab the kayak. There we go. Okay, it's upside down. Get, slip that left leg in there. Show me two hands. You're holding the kayak. Okay, you got to hold the kayak? Yes. Okay, now you're in a good position that someone can get you. I'm going to come over, and if it's noisy, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to tap my hand. That's going to mean, are you okay? No, you're going to tap the top of your head, okay? That's, that, that's a definite signal that I can see where anybody can see from a distance. You might not see an okay type thing, okay? okay. And I want to, and it may be noisy and everything else, so you don't have to have voice to do that. Okay, so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over, talk with you. I mean, some people, they sort of like they're in a little panic condition, so you want to calm them down. I'm going to come over now, and I'm actually going to swing around and grab her bow on my right side, only because it's convenient. Oh, yeah, I'm panicked. You better hurry. <laughs> okay, now, I'm going to grab this here. My paddle... I can probably put, yep, I gotta make sure I don't lose her boat. I can stick my paddle here, but a lot of people have, have spoon paddles, not gonna work. So what I end up doing is I put it between my legs, okay, or my, or my arms here, okay? So now I've got my paddle. I, I can put two paddles in here and hold it underneath my elbows, okay? So what I'm gonna do now, I'm gonna ask you to help me flip the kayak over. Okay, so I take my foot out. Take your foot out, hold on to the kayak, don't let go of it. Flip it over. Good. Now, hold on to the kayak. I I'm, I'm going to take this and twist me and you around this way. Okay. Now, this thing's going to get in the way. So I'm going to put it back here like this. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to flip. I'm going to start dragging it up this way. And you drag it up because it works. It used to drag it up upside down. It, that's an ugly way to do it. I'm going to drag it up this way. I'm going to drag it up about that far. Nice slide, and then I'm going to start laying it over. Don't don't hold on to it. Let go. Let go. Why you, you swing around the? Okay. What do you want me to do? Hold on to your boat. Or I want you to grab the back of your boat here, because swing around the stern, because I'm going to have you come around. Okay. Uh, can I move the skeg? Uh, I it. Okay, skeg's up. Okay. Yep. Okay, come around this side here, because that's the side you're going to do. Now what I'm going to do is, is and, and in, in the waves, I'm really stable. Any waves that come, i got a big T here. I'm never going to tip over, okay? So I'm going to slide this up, and as I'm doing this, I can, watch, I can watch the water coming out. If it goes the other way, you can't see the water. So I'm going to slide it up, keep sliding it up, and I can lean way back, get the water out. Come on, water. There we go all out pretty much now i'm going to drop it back and i'm going to slide it so i'm nose to nose because that's the best way there are times you, you can't do it you know nose to nose you get on this side here come over here hold on to the boat don't let go get get by the cockpit okay now what do you want because i don't really know i want point. you to get by the cockpit and the back of the cockpit the cockpit oh. yes sir okay now what I want you to do is go to the back of the boat, the back of the cockpit, right there, okay? I want you to put, uh, I'm going to grab my preferred way. Some people grab this. I usually grab this like this because i got tremendous leverage this way, and I can push this way, and these things are stuck across here, okay, out of the way. There's two ways. You like to jump right in, okay? She's strong enough to jump in. If you're not, and we won't do it, stick your left leg over over the top lay back along the side and that nope other leg other leg you're gonna roll in stick that leg in that's one way of getting in you put that and no you, you don't crunch up you lay back and roll up on the back deck you kick that bottom leg kick it and you roll right in okay that's that's the way that I do it and, and, and a lot of the the guys do now especially when you get older you haven't got the brute force to kick up on the back and women haven't got the brute force, and they have a bite life vest, and if they're busty, it makes it impossible to get over that hump. And we've seen that, and that they get hung up, and they haven't got the strength to pump over that thing. So putting the leg in is a great thing. Difficulty, if you've got a sharp combing, it stabs, it, it stabs your legs, and it gets you right underneath the knee. So what you end up doing is, is, is finding out what method is preferable to you. Karen, that you work that way, but she's strong enough and light enough that she can pop up in the back deck. 
one big mistake everybody makes is they, they, they crawl right up on the back before they hop up. You should hop up so your face is over the back deck or the, or the back combing or the back hatch because people will crawl into the kayak. They're desperate to get in the kayak. They'll come in so close then they can't get their feet down underneath it. And then you gotta slide them back and it's wavy and all that. So one of the big things is, for me being long, when I climb in, my face is over the back hatch and that's about the right length to, to slide my feet in, you see. Okay. You want me to, do you want to do what, you want to be Mike and do it again? Yeah, I don't yep, mind. Yep. All right, I'll be, I'll be the rescued. Okay. Right, right. <laughs> I guess, or she, I think she wants to. No, she wants no. to do my role. Yeah. Oh. I'm, I'm not going to do my role. role. But I'll watch if, if yeah. I'm, I'm not going in the water unless I accidentally do. <laughs> yeah, unless you screw up your role. Right. Oh, okay. All right, so you want me. Let well, me we want again. you to take your paddle. You have to put your third on because you need a paddle. Paddle. Well, the paddle's going to be in the way. A paddle will be there as. So, so whoa. Pat. Is that the wrong paddle? Oh, wrong paddle? Hold on. No. no. Yeah. Is that the wrong paddle? Yes. Yes, this one's fine. No, no, wrong, well, wrong paddle. You're so close. Give me, watch. Trust me. That's your paddle, yeah. No, it's not. It's too big. It's the right paddle because I can tell by the uh, grain here. You want to use this one, though? <laughs> all right, all right. Go I, ahead. All right, okay. Yeah, whenever she's ready. Where are we? Okay. I don't think so. I think that's... No, I don't pretty much. Right. I carved them. You carved them. I know. You know them better than me, but it doesn't feel like it's Well, you, you can't, it's hard to paddle into a T-bone. So you just grab it and then twist it. You grab it and twist the whole yeah. thing, yeah. And then I bring it partially up. Yep. Sort of go to the stern. Yep, drag bring it back. It drag it back, yep. Yeah. Far enough up so that I can... Watch the water pour out. The water pour out, lean back. Yep, yep. Yeah. And then I bring it back with the bow that way. Yep, nose to nose. Nose to nose. Like that. Okay. But I'm going to try and do the talking to her, too. You're going to talk her through it. Okay, that's usually the procedure, right. is that um, the person that falls over, panics. well, yeah. panics, or you can't assume, you assume that, that, that they're a little bit uh, yikesy. They're a little stuck up. Yeah, that's so, normal. and yeah. usually when we're paddling, the more experienced guy, gal, goes over and rescues the other person. So they're going to talk them through. Yes? Yes. Hold on to it because you're going to hand it to her. Yeah, now, because now it's a real. Don't worry, you won't get clunked. You're going to hold on to the paddle because you don't want to lose it because you're out in the middle of the ocean. Well, on the long the ocean. That's, that's why you end up using that foot because now you got a paddle and a hand and a, a leg and a foot. A leg and the cockpit. When you roll over, yeah, just. And you won't even have to do the thing you do. You're not doing the thing you do now. Yes. Hold on to that paddle. There you go. Get that foot in there. You got. You got. You got a hold of the kayak. You got your paddle. Good.
Don't worry about me. Yeah, stick it underneath your elbows. Both elbows. Karen, at, at this point, at this point, Karen, you want to flip the kayak over for her. That's right. Hold on to the, gut, the, the deck line. You got the spingy. You get the deck line. Okay. Oh. There you go. Get that hand. Pat. There you go. Okay, now twist it around. That's okay for now. You got you got the paddle. The other way, lean it towards you. Oh, towards her? So yes. See yep. Yeah. So she can see what's draining. That's it. Grab the deck line way down there. There you go. Lean it back into you. Lean back. You can't land back too much. It's very stable. Okay. Now, you're going to want to slide it back in so it's nose to nose. And that's not nose to nose yet. So twist it around. Hold on. Yep. Okay. Now, you are you are a little different than normal. You are you are not nose to nose. You're parallel. But we're going to continue that way because that's, you know, in the water you can't change around sometimes. So, uh, no, you know, like a kissing mode. Like when you kiss nose to nose, you know. Okay, flip her around then. Nope. Grab hold. What are you going to do? No, no, no. Stop, stop. Hold on. Hold on the paddle. Take, move down the deck line. And get hold of the bow. Twist your kayak around with her bow. Go on. Two. Two hands. Put those paddles underneath you. No, nope. there you go. Get those paddles underneath your elbows. There you go. Twist. Okay. Now, now, slide it back. Lift the paddles out of the way. Slide it back. Don't let it go of that deck line. Slide it back. There you go. Okay, now. Now I'm gonna put my right leg in. You put your on unless you want to do the hop in like you like like you normally yeah, do. I like, do you mind if I? Uh, no, because you want to do whatever, whatever you whatever however get in however you want. Okay, lay back. That's it. Kick that bottom leg and it'll flip right. You flip you right up. There you go. Yeah, I can see with that leg in. That's it. That's easy. And 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 Cindy, if someone's thrashing around with their feet, just quickly grab their foot and tuck it under. Okay. Now, do you want to do a rescue? I'll do a rescue yep. if you want. It yep. might be good for you as well to do the rescue to see how it feels. Now, but what I suggest for you is get your skirt back on. Get it on? Because you're going to tip over sideways. And, you know, maybe, you know, roll in it over and the water will come in the cockpit unless you've got your skirt on. Well, already, I need to tell you, but there's already water in the cockpit. Well, yeah, you, we didn't get it all out. Should we? No. Well, normally you'd stay there and you'd pump the water out, okay? Yeah. Yep. My my water bottle I think was full. All right. I gotta make sure my thing is. Okay. Let me get around the other side here. And this is all on video so you girls can get a copy and review it. Uh, there will be a test tomorrow. Well, it's handy to have a camera that then you can see what you're actually yeah. doing. Yeah, it's both. It really works well. What part did the rescue work? Well, I can show you the video on, with the computer this evening. Okay. Okay, you're all, you're all set in it? Good, okay. Skeg down. 
I mean up, I mean uh, up good. Uh, Check if she's okay. Yeah, I, well, sometimes two hands, but, you know, uh, okay. I, I can get mine off with one hand. Yeah. If you need two hands. I, I the other thing, too, some people have paddle leashes on. Yeah. And if it's tied to the deck, that makes one more thing that gets underground your feet. Right, yeah. So my, I used to use a paddle leash on my hand, okay, so it never got caught to the deck. Yep. All right. Okay. Me down the stern. Yes, please. Okay. At this point, so we need to flip, it over. flip it over. Flip it over. What, what you want? Yep. Well, if you stay down by the cockpit for that session, oh, okay. then you can flip it over easy. That's it. Lay it right on top of the skirt. Right next to you. Okay. Reach down, grab that deck line to your left. Down at the bottom. There you go. Okay. Slide it up. Lean it back towards you. Just lean your whole body back. There you go. Sl sl slide, uh, slide it a little farther up there. Of course, now the thing is, Karen's got a low volume boat. So it's it's almost at the leg. Okay, that's about it. Flip, flip, flip it back and slide it off on a one movement. Slide off the skirt. There you go. Now, dra drag it towards you. There you go. There you go. Oh, that's good because someday you will have to. Okay. So put your right leg. Yeah. Right. Now don't. You gotta grab it first. Okay. You need to get your right leg. Yeah. You need. Yeah. Put the put the oars under your chest. Okay. Slide back towards towards the front. Here. Put your hand. Right. Put that one hand out there. Out here. Yeah. Yep. Now those paddles are going to be in the way. They're going to stab you. Slide them farther out so they're laying across the front. There you go. There. Now that, yeah. So you see, you can hold contact there, and that elbow can hold right there. You get that out of the way, okay? Okay. And and you're gonna have to hold really tight. And now, Cindy, don't when you put your foot over, don't crunch up. Lay out straight. And if you can, okay, get it. Now kick that bottom leg like a frog and pull up. Kick again. Kick again. Grab. Grab her, grab her kayak if you wanna. Okay, now. Grab, grab hold of Karen's kayak to help stabilize you. Otherwise, you're gonna go right in between them. There you go. Okay, get the leg back. Carefully slide back. Now. need to stabilize the boat. I'm holding it. I'm holding it. Small girl. I'm holding it. Yep, you're doing good. Okay, now. Turn, turn towards Karen because you can see her boat and hold on to her boat. There, because if you turn the other way, you lose holding on her boat. Okay, now Karen, you're going to hold while she puts her skirt back in. We're, we're going to go through the skirt thing here too. No, we, we just want to go partial so get Karen so it can get used to 
hold in it while you get the skirt. Now, the thing is, of course, Karen's got to let go when you pop it up there, okay? Yeah. So, so they were all fine. Yeah. Good. Yeah. That was a good job. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was great. It was much harder for a lightweight. Yeah. 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 <laughs> for, for, I had to well, pull out. Light versus heavy versus heavy versus light. Yeah, so she just hopped up and I just, you know, I held on a little bit. <laughs>